another vlog? Where are we going? Where are we going yes. to? Uh, I don't know. A1 Pits. Oh. Mm. Good for watching. Subscribe, like and subscribe. Flynn's got a channel as well called F Fun Flynn. Yeah, exactly. <laughs>
It's going to be a bit, little bit colder, so I need to make sure I'm warm at least. I'm going to just sit this front chamber on, no door on, should I say. Better crack on. Ma voix à présent sur des breaks compressants Atmosphère pesante, rien n'est plus comme avant Hip hop léger sur des breaks saisissants Atmosphère pesante car rien n'est plus comme avant Hip hop léger Now, one thing in winter I'll tell you something Always ask a bailer's advice because they're, they're here all the time And this peg I'm going to be fishing now has got form, especially in winter. It's the middle of peg four, I think it's peg four, and about 30 yards out, the last fish came out, mid 20, or lower 20, one or two, wasn't listening that much. But also, it's low pressure, 10 degrees, I'm gonna put the bivvy up, and, to be perfectly honest, and I'm just gonna uh, try and catch a fish, but most importantly, enjoy myself. Are you excited? Yeah. It's good to be out? Yeah. Enjoying fishing? Yeah. Even though you're not fishing? Yeah, even though I'm not fishing. How come you don't want to fish, just enjoying your new uh, Nintendo you've got for Christmas? Um, I like camping. Just uh, like camping. Like most men, apparently. They like camping too. Give us a thumbs up and see you later. We'll do your tea now, yeah? Yeah. You having chicken? I don't know. <laughs> See you in a bit, but I'll just go and get, I'll get the cooker on. Yeah. You're happy? Yeah. Good. So, the sun is starting to set. Love it. To be honest, it's been quite a long time since I got out. It's been about two months. I've just been busy with bits and pieces. This is looking stunning. I mean, I've got a bit of a light on top of the camera now, so you can see me because it's that light, that dark. But um, hmm, it's good to see you again. Don't forget to like and subscribe, press the bell button, and get some notifications. And put a comment below what you think about uh, some of the gear I got sent from Pro Logic. Not sponsored by Pro Logic. Not paid me at all to give me a load of stuff to try and put in the videos. So I have, and it's free. Why wouldn't you? Yeah, exactly. Why wouldn't you? So hmm, it's good. Well, it's night time now, and you know, I have to tell you something. I completely forgot how cold it gets at night time. It gets at night time. I've not been able to get my words out today for some reason. And um, I'll just switch this off. Switch off. I've got a light. I won't switch off. Got it. And um, I don't know where it is. In the earlier parts of the videos, I kept saying, um, 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 like I've never done this before. Anyway, little tip, said it to you last year. Never go out fishing in winter like your parabolic eater. One of that, one of them. Always make sure you're well ventilated as well. Have a little gap at the top, but seriously, you need this because it gets really cold in winter and you've got to be warm. Flynn's staying in the car where it's warm. So what I've got to do now is just put a little ventilation thing, a little, a little letterbox at the top, just up there. Not much, just enough to give me a little bit of comfort so I don't kill myself with carbon dioxide poisoning. I should have got one of those little sensors that goes off alarms that goes off to be perfectly honest, but hey ho, I haven't. Uh, and all I've got to do now is chill out. Now, another little tip. I've got bad knees, so the little mat here, inside the bivvy, that, yeah, little bivvy mat, for some reason in winter I feel it more on my knees when I bend down and stuff, maybe it's because I'm getting older but I'm not entirely sure why, so when I put this little mat down inside, on the floor, when I sort my rig stuff out and I come to kneel down, 
to stop some knees from hurting. Now I'm old, I'm getting older, and it's clearly a problem for me, so hence why I use it. But I've not brought the magic carpet with me this time as well. You know, like kind of the plastic floor that I had in the last video, uh, at the end of November I think it was, not quite Christmas. I've not brought them because I've, I was just going to do a quick overnighter, and uh, it's very windy. To be honest, I couldn't be bothered. No, I couldn't be bothered. So, let's see if we catch a fish in the morning. I know it's not much of a vlog, you're just getting out for the first time and it's, I'll be looking at some things as well tomorrow morning. We'll go through things. What should we have a look at? Uh, you know what? I know what we will have a look at. We'll have a look at that ProLogic um, bag with the two air dry bags in it. It seemed kind of pointless when I got it. I looks like I'm not going to use that, but to be honest, I do use it. It's all right. It's good. Uh, it's a bag, but I like it. It's a good bag. It's the middle of the night. It's deadly still. I can't actually hear a fish jumping or any movement at all. This is definitely winter fishing. There's not a lot of uh, activity on the bank either. Most of the anglers have gone home. So there's a, only a few anglers here, it's pitch black and Flynn spending the night in the car because it's middle of the winter he's, uh, he's keeping him there he's, uh, there he is fast asleep on the back seat of the car in a sleeping bag where he's nice and safe away from any wind but you wouldn't think it was going to be like this today tonight should I say because uh, I think it might freeze tonight because there's no cloud cover so I may wake up in the morning to a frosted over lake, a lid, I reckon so. But it's still currently about two degrees, two, three degrees. So it's not got a chance of doing so yet. A little bit of breath coming out of my mouth. So what I've got to do now is just uh, relax. The train's still going past as you can hear. I do like these lakes, they're kind of cool, but hmm, it's winter, <laughs> it's good to get out but I forgot, I really sincerely forgot how long these snacks last because it's currently 10 o'clock, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to have a nightcap, a drink of tea, dunk a biscuit and try and get some sleep. A bit eerie really. Like, subscribe, press up the bell button and listen by all means. Tell me what you'd be doing now. I'm guessing it'd be in front of the fire at, at home watching match of the day. <laughs> I must be mad. I'll uh, if we don't catch a fish beforehand I'll see you in the morning. Sleep. The sun's not quite come up, and this is the first night where it's chucked it down, and the material on this bivy is great. It's really good, really good. And believe it or not, I've got no or very little condensation very little. Bear in mind there's no winter skin on it. Love it. Absolutely love it. And one of the benefits of that is there's a, I keep on saying it's sewn in. It's not sewn in. It's zipped in ground sheet. I zip it in and great. So far really good. Really, really good. That helps a lot. I'm gonna flat back as well. Big flat back on it. Yep. 
it's high so you can you're not you know being honest it's truthful because it's high you're not crouched over all the time so much I mean I'm, I'm not a big bloke, big bloke by any means solid bit of kit it's really solid So we stood up to wind, rain, cold temperatures. It's all right. Still no fish. I'm here until tea time, so you know what I'm going to do now because the sun's not come up and it's cold, wet, and raining. I'm going to go to bed. And over there. Oh, I'm not sure if that's a dead coot. Black chicken. I'm not sure if it's a dead one or not. It looks dead. I don't know where it is. Find out in good time, I suppose. It's cold, wet. It's winter. Right. Going back to bed for an hour. Might as well, eh? Might as well. Hmm. Trains have just started this morning. I miss them. I really do. That's right about that coop. What? Yeah. Do you want it? What? Yeah, you can have my tea. Have it, it's well sugar, it's how you like it anyway, it's just ready to drink. Flynn's got his YouTube channel. Fun Flynn, don't forget to subscribe. Are you enjoying yourself in there? Mm. Yeah, I'm We're going in a bit. Oh, Flynn's got to get dressed. That's pit five. Out there. Just the rain's just stopping now. Nobody fishing it there now, everyone's gone. It's now 12 o'clock. Let's have a look. I think they've all gone now. It's on the hardcore out now, Sunday. I think they're watching the football, enjoying themselves. Why not? <sighs> what do you do? What do you do? Let's have a look around. There were a couple of chaps over on the other bank over there yesterday. I'm not sure whether they caught anything or not. I am not sure. The birds are moving around in the middle part of the lake, but the birds seem to be down this side, side of the lake here, on the back of the wind. Warmer water. I'm just on the edge of that as it pushes over. But I haven't seen a fish move, show, or anything. I've been watching the water, using my binoculars, looking and seeing if there's any bubbles, flat spots, anything showing on the lake. And even when I'm vlogging, I keep on looking at the lake. I can't stop looking at the lake. I need to try and see a fish move. I'm not seeing anything. This is winter. Stupid comment in itself, but it's definitely winter. You see, not a lot. Hmm. Still good to get out, though. It is still good to get out. Oh well. Better get Flynn dressed and get packed up and get home. Si je pose ma voix à présent sur des blagues de pressant, atmosphère pesante, rien n'est plus comme avant. Léger sur des breaks saisissants, atmosphère pesante car rien n'est plus qu'on meurt. Hip hop léger sur des breaks saisissants. Oh, I can't see any fish, 
be getting the binoculars out. I bought some, well I didn't buy some, a friend of mine bought some binoculars for me, which is just there. And I've been scanning the water all the time. One of the things in winter is, is always check the water, keep on looking, look for signs, and to be perfectly honest, I've seen nothing. I've seen no flat spots, I've seen nothing whatsoever. So I've been looking at the, the water, and nothing. But one thing I want to highlight is something. I had this bait bag sent to me. Again, it's a ProLogic thing. I've got all my pop-ups in there, you know. You get two bags that come inside it. This is like a nice little bag to put your stuff in. It's also insulated as a freezer bag. You can even utilize it as a, as a food bag as well for your meats and that kind of thing in the summer. Or for your mackerel if you're pike fishing or sea fishing. Nice little handle, durable, durable zip on it. Not a cheap poxy zip on it you get on some of them. A really good quality zip. Most importantly with the ProLogic stuff is the little tags. These little things here. One of the biggest problems about the tackle companies, especially the bags and the luggage, is devices held to the, the zip. The little, you know, thumb tab there. These are really well made. These, this is my big bob bear. I usually use Aqua, but all of the actual tags keep on coming off. Where this, it's a solid bit of kit. Yeah, and what you get with it as well are two air dry bags, like so. And again, well made. Two, two kilo of bait in there, just two kilo. I don't know what it is with this video. I can't seem to get my words out. It don't seem to be normal. Don't comment. I did comment. It's up to you. But yeah, I'm happy with that. Two kilo. I've got four kilo of bait with me now. I've used put a kilo in on three rods. And I've got the other bag down there. Now I thought I actually wouldn't use these bags. I thought, well, I've got some normal bags that I use, like. You know, like a sack, an air dry sack with a little handle on. I actually do prefer these. Love them to bits. And because they're kind of small and compact, you can put them away in your tackle a lot easier. And they're easier to get to, they're easier to work with than having a bag. I like them. The synopsis of this is it was a trip down to the offices in the Midlands to pick some pieces up to put in video and I have to say I'm impressed with the quality of the stuff so far. The spot rod, the reel, the bait bag, the bivvy, they've come a long way. Um, but regarding the quality of kit and what it's like, yeah, it's alright, it's good, it's good. Whether they have heard from uh, ProLogic again, I don't know. They seem to choose when they want to speak to you. And that's not just ProLogic, there's other tackle companies and bait companies as well. Don't get it, don't want to get it. Right. I'm not going to waste my time being here all day. I only came to do a quick overnight and, and test the bivvy in the, in the wind and rain. I've done that. Good bit of kit. Don't like the storm poles that they provide. The, the do, storm poles are terrible. I won't even call them storm poles. I call them sticks, not storm poles. The gardener ones are storm poles. I've got them on the bivvy now. They're good. I've used them on the front. The way it's constructed, these are putting up. Cow sheet is a bit tricky putting it in. Uh, if I'm honest, there's no other way of doing it. Zipping it in's the best way of doing it, but it's the most fiddliest way of doing it. Saves all the rats and the uh, little mice and stuff coming in the winter because they're prevalent in winter. Not caught any fish as yet. I'm going to make another drink of tea. I'm warm, I'm comfortable. Most importantly, I've got you watching the video as well, so I appreciate it.
Big thumbs up on the Vivi and the bait bag as well. Nothing, nothing caught. It's just a video, isn't it? Just getting out fishing. <sighs> so, recap. Doing the PVA bag full of crushed boilies. Didn't work. Um, the running rig with a little um, running rig on. Whatever you want to call it, running rig, I don't know, flippery, I don't know, I don't know what the proper name of it is. Don't care to be perfectly honest, just used it. So we're just going to uh, start packing up now. Get myself back up the motorway, about an hour and a half home from here. Hmm. Be out again though, still good fun to get out. Thanks for watching, like, subscribe, press that bell button and comment below. Good to see you again.